Guys, the gift that Bobby sent us for winning the tournament is finally here. I'll get a crowbar. Oh, no need. Third degree black belt, I'm always packing two. beautiful thing I've ever seen. Um, what is it? It's a dude. <laughs> it's not a dude. It's a piece of film history. This is a statue of Bobby Wasabi from his classic 1974 movie, Dojo of Wax. Okay, so it's a dude made of wax. <laughs> I don't get it. How's this stupid statue supposed to show everyone that we're his number one dojo? Don't you dare talk in that tone. And when Bobby comes here for the picture tomorrow, you better act grateful. Yo, this thing's kind of creeping me out. Its eyes are following me everywhere I go. What's that? Oh, it's a sign we got from my uncle's junkyard. I used to hang over the men's store downtown. We're number one? We didn't take the part that said, in men's underpants. I never understood why that store closed. They sold great underpants at a fair price. Okay, well, what's the sign doing here? <laughs> that dumb statue isn't going to show anyone we won the tournament. Yeah, it's our way of letting people know we're number one. Oh, especially cute girls who can read. That's right, I have a type. <laughs> oh, come on, at least let us turn it on. Let's see what it looks come like on. lit up. OK, fine, yeah, go ahead and plug it in. Like, go, go. All right. Hold on, hold on. Ready? Ready? Oh, great. Your cruddy sign blew our power out. I think our cruddy sign blew the power out. <laughs> it's not just us. The power's out in the whole mall. What? Yeah. Oh, no. No, no, no. There's no air conditioning. It's already getting warmer in here. Oh, no. oh this isn't good. Exposure to temperatures above 74 degrees will cause statue to soften and result in permanent disfigurement. Oh, that's it. My life is over. Bobby's gonna be here in four hours for the photo shoot, and when he gets here, he's gonna meet Blobby. <laughs> Blobby Wasabi. That's Shut it, Jerry! Man, this is the worst heat wave the city's ever had. And because of us, everyone's air conditioning's out. <sighs> At least no one knows it's our fault. I know it was your fault! <laughs> you karate people! You did this! Because of your fancy underpants sign, my meat is going bad, and my goat is drinking out of the toilet bowl. <laughs> Phil, Phil, I tried calling an electrician, but they're all busy. Okay, you come with me to the roof. If I don't get the power back on, my wife will go crazy and miss the latest episode of The Real Housewives of Hachmachistan. Rudy, what about the statue? What should we do? Just take him someplace cold, all right? If it melts, my dream of being on the cover of Karate Fancy melts with it. Don't worry, nothing's gonna happen to the statue. All we gotta do is take it someplace cold. Let's go. We should probably bring Bobby with us. It's okay, it's okay. I put him there. He's not alive. Lizard Sanchez goes to the box for a two minute penalty. Penalty box. This one's taken. Whoa. I don't think you should be eating that fish. It's for the penguins. Oh no, this little guy doesn't mind. See, that's the thing about penguins. They're very generous, right? <laughs> His mother doesn't seem too happy. No, 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 dude, trust me. Dude, penguins are really. What happened to him? Ugh. Old lady, hockey player, angry penguin. We've all been there. <laughs> Guys, Bobby's gonna be here in one hour for the photo shoot. Oh, he's right. Everyone put on your geese. I want you all sparring when Bobby gets here. <laughs> Why don't you go next door and get yourself a flea bath? You smell like fish. <laughs> Swag? 